Hello Exiles, every day more people are discovering this awesome build, especially after some of the more famous streamers have also started to play this build. Along with that the demand and the prices for certain items are getting higher. And this is why I wanted to make this short video to help you craft your own gear and maybe save you some currency. First piece of the gear which will be the biggest upgrade for you but the lowest investment is the belt percent dexterity implicit. They are currently selling around 1 exalt for base with values of 13-15% to dexterity implicit. Let's jump straight to the craft of our Siege Ballista belt. For this crafting we are going to use Deafening Essence of Sorrow. These essences cost around 7-8 to eight chaos if you buy them in, in smaller quantities. If you buy them in bulk they can cost up to 1 exalt for 14 pieces. Every time we use Essence of Sorrow, it will always give us on belts, rings and other items which are not weapons, 51 to 58 dexterity. Since this is really important stat for us, this is the best way to craft your gear. Because it's always guaranteed that we are going to get the dexterity. Before we start crafting with essences, we should always use Instinct Catalyst on our belt to increase the quality of it and also to increase all of the attributes and now you can see we have implicit with 18% of increased dexterity if you maybe have a belt with 13% dexterity you can increase it with blessed orbs and now let's try our luck so the main goal what we are searching for is dexterity of course and some life resistances which we need and also additionally if we maybe get elemental damage to attacks or maybe an open prefix as well. And we, we hit a decent one. Now on this one, we have already all three suffixes filled. We got dexterity, cold resistance and fire resistant. We got really nice tier one life. We got some mana, which is an okay stat for us, but nothing important. But still we have one open prefix, which means we can still craft increased elemental damage with attack skills on it. Let's take it now and craft it on our bench. Let's see if there are any belts like this on the market. Currently there is one listed at 40 exalt. To craft this belt it costed us 1 exalt for the base and less than 1 exalt for essences because we were so lucky. So that means even if you are unlucky I think you will craft this quicker with less investment than to buy this for 40 exalts. Now let's jump to the rings. So with rings it's a little bit more tricky and I would always suggest that this is your second upgrade. And I would always suggest to you that this is the second piece of gear which you will be upgrading. Because only the base is around 11 to 12 exalted orbs. So we have quite a lot of initial investment before you start to craft it. The crafting process is totally the same like for the belt we used before. So first we put some instinct catalysts. To improve the quality of our ring and also to increase the attributes and then we just use deafening essences of sorrow and we hit something quite good it's not the best one but it's also not the bad one we still have an open prefix and we also have an open suffix. Since we got the chaos res, which on this build it's really hard to acquire, 
We can also craft some other resistances because we also have an open suffix. Let's go to the crafting bench. Let's check what would be the cost of this ring. So a ring like this would be sold between 15 and 20 exalted orbs. We invested around 11 exalted orbs in base and in less than one exalted orbs worth of essences we got our result. It is not the best one, but it's a decent one. This will be it for our short crafting video guide. Please, if you need some help or have some any other questions, leave a comment below. If you like my videos, please click like and subscribe. Thank you.